Yes, beautiful people, we are back. You boy, Usama, DJ Sava, two British nerds back at you. Feeling a bit cold right about now. This is why I've got like the woolly hat, the Guardians of the Galaxy Groot scarf, and the nice fleecy, um, literally zip up hoodie that my uncle gave to me. What's up? So, 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 so. This video vlog isn't clickbait whatsoever. It was basically simply yesterday, simply yesterday, I made a big mistake. And the mistake was basically, I said in yesterday's vlog, after getting gassed and excited over the Black Widow teaser trader, I said, oh, after, um, it's, it'll be, it's really cool to basically see what happens to Black Widow after Avengers Endgame and where her story actually takes place and what happens to her. And then obviously I didn't know what I was saying because I, was, I, I got so mixed up. And uh, yeah, because she's dead, right? There is no, the, the movie isn't basically a, a, a sequel or it's a part two to anything or whatever it might be. It's basically the fact that, you know, she is dead and it's a prequel movie that's set literally, I believe, right after Captain America Civil War, if I can remember correctly. Um, I was so out of it yesterday that I didn't realize what I was saying until basically I read the comments basically um, yesterday. And a shout out to Steve, is it Steve Fox? Um, or, yeah, I think he dropped me a comment and said, bro, like, what are you talking about? She's dead. And I was like, oh shit, she is dead. Um, but it was hilarious because what I, was, what I was going through my mind yesterday was, was one, my parents came out from France and I was in a rush to go home and meet them, get, get, grab them food and stuff. I was so gassed and excited over the, the Black Widow teaser trailer, basically. And I think what made me think that it was, what made me say, it, uh, you know, that, you know, the movie takes off, takes takes place after Avengers Endgame was the fact basically when she in the trailer she mentions she she says oh I had family and I was like oh wow shit so anyways all of that to basically say the reason the out the, the positive thing the positive aspect from from making that big mistake yesterday was the fact that it gives me content to speak about literally today and it's something that Gary Vaynerchuk basically said many many times you know the way he creates his content is he reads the comments comments so I read the comments and I saw someone said, bro, you messed up. She is dead. And I was like, cool, let me correct it. Now, most people, they would have deleted basically the comment or they would have basically deleted the whole video, re-recorded it and put it out. Me, I was like, nah, man, my mistake is my mistake. You know, it's, I made a mistake, but it's good to have that on record. But from reading the comments, I actually did the most coolest and basically easiest thing I created content from my mistake by actually reading the comments that was left on my YouTube channel so this is why I actually love people when they leave me comments because all of your comments that actually are left on my YouTube channel allows me to basically to of course to make content and that's something very cool and amazing because I like to sorry I keep shaking the table um, it's really amazing because it allows me to create more content via the, 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 the contents, your comments that you basically leave for me. So I'm pretty happy about that. Also, what I'm really excited about is from seeing the teaser trailer, like I said in yesterday's vlog, it's a, it feels like a combination of James Bond meets basically um, John Wick. And I can't wait to basically see that. Even even my friend of mine just now, I said to him, don't you think it was like, it was like the movie was like a combination of John, the, the Black Widow teaser trailer was like a combination of John Wick and James Bond. He was like, yeah, he goes, too bad the James Bond trailer wasn't that great. And it, to be honest, the James Bond trailer, when I watched it, it was very flat. I was like, mm, nah, not for me, man. It just seems like the whole essence of Bond has been like, kind of just, it's just, I don't know. It's just been taken in another direction that I'm not really feeling, but I'll still watch it. Cause I like, I do like the Bond movie. So I look forward to see what happens in this movie. But overall, I don't have my, my, um, my hopes up but then again I could be surprised the movie, the movie could the movie could actually be a very sick dope movie so yeah shout to the phone popping off uh, oh okay my hands are cold by the way so that's pretty much it I guess message of the day whatever mistakes you make on video if you think they're imperfect if you're not happy with them if you've made the biggest mistake basically on your video put them out you know don't delete them don't hesitate put them out you never know what could happen they could be like they could be disliked but I would rather you put out content than you not actually putting out content because you made a silly mistake which can be rectified or because you have too much pride or like you 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 feel that basically it makes you insecure that you've made a mistake because you feel now based when you put it out there that people are gonna roast you in the comments when no one really cares so message of the day again put out your content even if you make a silly mistake like me to thinking Black Widow was still alive. I don't know why I thought that. To whatever mistake you make, put the content out and let the people consume. I keep shaking the table, sorry. I keep hitting my knee on it. And let the people consume basically your content and see what it's basically saying. Um, 
yeah, that's literally all I have to say. 100%. Hope everyone is well and of course literally doing well. As always, smash that YouTube subscribe button, smash the YouTube bell button. And if you need me for anything and everything, drop your comments down below, DM me and we can talk. And of course your comments mean the world to me. So please drop your comments down below and let me know what you th thought of this video. Actually no, let me do it another way. Question of the day. What do you think of my Guardians of the Galaxy group <laughs> scarf? And actually, yeah, no, no, yeah, yeah. And of course, the biggest question is, what did you think of the Black Widow teaser trailer? Drop your comments down below. Let me know. Peace.